Hi, before this film begins, I would just like to talk about a few things. First, this film was made in under one week, which was because of a time constraint we had. We made this film for a competition in my college and we won the second place, which is why I would like to thank the actor in this film, Rishabh, and also the actor in this film, Rohak, who played Rishabh's double. And they both really did support me throughout the process. Another thing I wanted to point out was that this film may not look so good according to the VFX or certain camera movements point of view because we estimated two weeks of making this film when we signed up for the competition but the event managers messed up with the whole time and they gave us a week less so I had to render the 3D models and everything within two days which is why it looks terrible in certain shots, not all of them. Overall this film turned out to look excellent but this film was actually a byproduct of the main script. I had a script in mind which was like 30 minutes long and it was a lot more deeper and more confusing and there's a lot more going on in it. So I will be making a full movie instead of a short film from the script I wrote and that will come out later this year. I don't know when I'll just I'm still in the pre-production of that film, so that's it for now. You can enjoy the film. I spoke enough. You know, I do. If it wasn't for Mr. Shah and his family, who have tried to destroy my family's business every time, I would be going to places right now. But instead, I'm helping my dad to pay up the bank for the loss. And why the loss? Mr. Shah. If there was only a way to erase him from existence, I am sure that would make you feel a lot better, Akash. Exactly. If there was a way to remove him from his existence, That's it. Last time my dad got me something expensive. He got me the C3 prototype. It's time to use it to its fullest potential. Exactly. What are you going to do, Akash? Let's go back in time and kill the younger Mr. Shah. Well, I hate to tell you this, Akash, but it won't work because of the grandfather's paradox. Not now, Artu. I have to save my family. Go to sleep mode.
Are you me from the future? Is that even possible? No, Akash. I'm not from the future. I'm from an alternate reality which you created. I created a reality. When did that happen? When you tried killing Mr. Shah for the second time. But that makes no sense. How? Wait a second. You know what? You need this. Here you go. The flow of time is altered, affects the already existing waveform of time, and creates something even worse. When you altered time, nothing changed in your reality because of the grandfather's paradox. But a new reality was created. Mind. If you read more about parallel realities, according to Erwin Schrödinger, states that two states of an atom splits and creates multiple realities. Every time a new choice is made, or time itself is altered. This world is getting apocalyptic. You have to undo what you have done trying to save my world from war. Th th this is hard to take in. Supposing I accept that I created your apocalyptic world, what does the grandfather's paradox mean? Supposing you went back in time to kill a person. Once you kill him and come back, that person never existed. This means that you never thought of killing him as he never existed. Which is why you never went back in time. The entire event loops around and the present day ends up exactly the same with no change. No matter how many times you try, nothing in your timeline will change. You will end up in a very big time loop. What also happened in your cases, apart from being affected by this paradox, your doings were affected by Schrodinger's equation as well. This caused my reality to exist. Wow, that's a lot to take in. My head's spinning. How did you travel between realities though? Is that even possible? Yes, it is. In my timeline, there was no time traveling. It was always traveling between parallel realities. So what do I have to do to stop your reality from expanding? Stop yourself. Stop yourself when you went to kill him for the third time. Wear the hoodie which I gave you. Make sure that he doesn't notice you. Akash, I am from the first reality which you created and I am going to be in your life.